obvious question, Jack, is uh, how did it feel to get your first career goal and, 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 you know, kind of walk us through it if you would. Yeah, it's obviously a very exciting night for myself. Great to get the win. So that adds on to that. Um, the play was a good play by Rich at the blue line and then a really skilled play for Kretsch to find me there and um, just put it in the net. If we went to your house and you, you showed us your, your uh, collection of first pucks, you know, what's in it? Um, first junior goal, first NHL game, first NHL point, and then uh, now this one. This one probably takes the cake. Thank you. We'll go next to Jason Scales. Jason, you got us? Okay. Let's go to Sophia Yerkstevich. Jack, I didn't have a chance to ask you, but what are you actually going to do with the puck? Are you keeping it? Or are you sending it home to, to family? And then as a follow-up, you're sitting beside uh, Tuca right now as a new member of the team. What was it like watching him stand on his head and bail you guys out in overtime? Thanks. Yeah, I actually said on the bench uh, to Wags how I would not want to go in a shootout against Tukes just because uh, how calm he is in there. So uh, definitely kept us in the game. So that was awesome. And then the first part of the question, uh, I'll probably give it to someone special to me, whether that's my dad or, or my grandpa, uh, someone like that. So, um, you know, a lot of supporting cast have helped me get to this point. So um, I'll probably choose somebody. Thank you. Ken Powtak. Ken, go ahead. Jack, did you just feel that energy level just lift for the team when you got that goal? Because you guys have been struggling to get an even strength goal. Uh, I think intermission had a lot to do with it uh, prior to my goal. Um, you know, we know we're an offensive group in there, so just try not to get frustrated. And then, um, you know, obviously it was, it was fortunate that puck started going in. Jimmy Murphy. Hey, Jack. Um, just to, you know, in terms of what you've been trying to do since you've been up, I mean, your goal was one where you, you know, you go to the net there. Is that something you were focusing on more and trying to improve on as you went on? Yeah, maybe. Uh, I think it was mostly a team mentality thing, this game to try to get to the net and keep things simple. Um, you know, I'm playing with a, a really good centerman in Kretsch, so uh, just try to get to the net, keep my stick on the ice, find some open ice, and uh, most of the time he finds you. So, uh, yeah, I, I, I think so, especially playing with Kretsch. And just one, one follow-up, guys. Sorry, Tuka, um, just, you know, you guys, Bruce mentioned it before, you guys haven't had much luck in the shootouts. I know you haven't been a big fan in the past. Uh, just what was it like to get one of those tonight? Well, I think it was kind of the same situation as the first game against Jersey. You know, I, th I thought we played pretty good, you know, and then we finally found a lot of offense in the third period. And, you know, it was kind of back and forth, crazy game with, with a lot of, you know, goals and bounces here and there. So uh, it feels good to win those games. Obviously, you know, we, we saw that, you know, losing last seconds in the OT, that's the other end of the spectrum there. So, you know, you know, it's, if it's a tight game, goes to shootout, as a goalie, you're just trying to give your team a chance to win. And, no, this year we won two more than last year altogether, I guess. Thanks, man. Nice jacket. Thank you. Phil Stacy, go ahead. Tuka, could you talk about uh, the two, uh, what I would say were big saves in overtime, the, the glove stop out front on Voracek and then that pad stop uh, while you were down on uh, Kevin Hayes? Yeah, the first one, <clears throat> I mean, I saw Voracek was all by himself in front of the net. You know, the D-man or whoever kind of shot a floater in there. Uh, you know, he made a good play, just try to tip it in my five hole and the rebound was laying there. So I just, you know, try to get extended as much as possible. And I think it haven't hit my glove there. And then the second one, you just, you see that develop. The guy was kind of slowing down in the wing and Hayes, he was driving, driving the net wide and, and uh, they made a good play, but I just happened to extend my, my leg there. Uh, Timmy Rosenthal. Hey guys, can you hear me? Yep. Yep. Uh, for uh, Jack, I imagine you didn't think your first goal would come after a long uh, five on five scoreless streak, nor would it come in front of an empty crowd. But how much do you appreciate now just being here, being able to contribute, even with all those circumstances there? Yeah, um, special night, regardless of the situation. Obviously, it's just the world we live in right now. So 
uh, still going to enjoy it, obviously. So, um, you know, I've seen this team come back in the third period uh, over the past couple of years so many times. So uh, to be a part of that tonight, that was, uh, that was special. Thanks, Jack. Thanks, Tuca. That's it. Awesome. Thanks, guys. Thank you.